Well, Happy New Year again, everyone. This is Sunday, January the 8th, 2023. Uh, can you imagine how quickly the time flies and, and how quickly in the church cha uh, calendar we also move? So today we are celebrating the baptism of the Lord. And of course, we know our Lord was baptized at the, around the age 30. So he was an infant last week, and today he's 30 years old. Don't worry, we're still going to sing We Three Kings of Orient Are, because we kind of missed Epiphany a little. Well, we begin with the grace. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Almighty God, to you all hearts are open, all desires known, and from you no secrets are hidden. Cleanse the thoughts of our hearts by the inspiration of your Holy Spirit, that we may perfectly love you and worthily magnify your holy name. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Lord, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. The Collect for the Baptism of the Lord. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. O Eternal Father, who at the baptism of Jesus revealed him to be your Son, anointing him with the Holy Spirit, keeping your children born of water and the Spirit, faithful to their calling. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Please join with me in the words of the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. And say it with me as well. Glory to God, whose power working in us can do infinitely more than we can ask or imagine. Glory to God from generation to generation in the church and in Christ Jesus forever and ever. Amen. And before I give the final blessing, I encourage you to look at the bulletin this week in the email because it includes a lot of future dates when the Black History Service will take place, when Ash Wednesday is. Yes, there will be a pancake supper this year. And of course, we will have a Lenten uh, Bible study as well, a couple of places in people's homes, and also two of the evenings will be right here in our own church sanctuary. Well, now may the peace of God, which passes all understanding, keep your hearts and minds in the knowledge and love of God and of his Son, Jesus Christ our Lord, and the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with you today and always. Amen.